what's funded and what isn't. When you look around with where Urkel is spending money versus what is collapsing, it's pretty interesting, isn't it? Yeah, pretty damn interesting. And unacceptable. Unacceptable. That's why we're not spending money. And we have another comment. Sarah is exposing leaders that I like for what they really are. I keep being amazed by her ability to draw out the truth. And what was the truth this week? What was the monumental event this week? Getting into the Sarah update and type, 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 send. Some people get confused thinking that I'm mocking her. No, I'm not. If you can change Senate legislation by posting two things on Facebook that speaks to a level of influence and power that is unparalleled. And my example for you, Barack Hussein Obama feels the sick, narcissistic need to be on television virtually every single day. In one way or another, you're hearing that fool open his pie hole, and there's no pie in it, and that's the mistake. Every single day he's somewhere. Every single media outlet, with the few exceptions, are ferrets in his pants. No, he's not just happy to see us. That's the New York Times in there. Oh, yeah. This is a man whose approval ratings are plunging, who despite having enormous popular ratings, and the first Democrat to win the popular vote since Jimmy Carter, in a few short months, is unable to convince even his own party to do what he wants. Because you know what? As Margaret Thatcher said, problem with socialism is you eventually do run out of other people's money and in this instance if you set everybody on fire there's nobody going to be left to vote for you oh, that's right so this is a guy who can't even with being in washington every media outlet in his pants he's the president of the united states he's a young man he's on tv every day he is wrecked his agenda is wrecked by Sarah Palin doing type, 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 send. Two Facebook posts. Now, let me tell you also, they made a decision to counter her. Barack Obama did not refer to her by name, but it was the death panel revelation. And it's true. Look, what do you think is going to manage Obama death care? It's going to be panels. This is a man who has a czar and a panel for getting up in the morning. He has the left or right leg first czar. He has the, do I put my socks on first or do, do I put them on after my pants czar? He has the, how many ferrets can I get up my leg today czar? You know what they need, though? They really need a how Michelle Obama should dress czar. Her staff has so, got such a huge budget. You'd think they'd put somebody on there who would have her. When she was dressing in J. Crew, she looked better than the way she's dressing now. You'd just think that for Michelle Antoinette, with all that money, that, that she could hire someone to shop for her. Is that too much to ask? Crying out loud. So... Of course, he's going to have a panel making decisions about costs because when people are the budget and you got to cut the budget, Sarah Palin defines that in one Facebook post. They hit back, meaning that they're taking it seriously. Obama mentions it. Democrats and Republicans start calling her nuts again and then mocking, oh, look, she's put, posting on Facebook. Ha, 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 ha. Then she does type, 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 slap. She responds to Obama's criticisms with details, with the bill itself, and other analysis. And within about 36 hours, Grassley announces from the Senate that they have removed that provision because of its potential to be misused. Thank you very much. There are 100 senators in the Senate of the United States. While I'm grateful that Sarah Palin has the, for, for being an irrelevant quitter, she is an amazingly powerful, influential typist, apparently. Whatever the reason, why it took Sarah Palin to post on Facebook to get Chuck Grassley to do the right thing is beyond me. 
Nobody else suggested it or noticed it or cared. That's her power. It is also a sign of also, why I'm going independent, why this show is now completely independent, the power of new media. You can have as many old media ferrets up your damn pants circle as you want. Something else is going on. And even though he wants to shut down the Internet like talk radio, it, would t it will take too long. We have enough of a window to stop him. We're already doing it. Look, we're already doing it. The irrelevant quitter changes Senate legislation because of a posting. Type. Well, she could be anywhere with today's technology, right? As far as I know, she's on a beach somewhere. Maybe she's sitting in an igloo with a polar bear. Uh, whatever you want to think of Sarah Palin. She has a laptop and an Internet connection. And she's changed Senate legislation. But not on her own. Combined with you town hall patriots. She is now not a lone voice in the wilderness. She is, I've said this before, whoever tapped into the nature of what we were doing first, who has national aspirations, would be the winner. And she's it. Whether you like her or not, and a lot of conservatives don't, she's it. Uh, Newt Gingrich hasn't figured it out yet. Newt Gingrich, who is a perfectly nice man, I like him and his wife very much. But there is a reason why he's not in government. And now this small segment. There are attacks coming from both the right and the left. Some of the attacks on the right you might not recognize as an attack, but it is. At least an effort to affect her effectiveness. Right? Everybody in Washington, D.C., whether they be a Republican or a Democrat, have a vested interest in things remaining the way they are. Ronald Reagan was a threat. He had never been in Washington until he moved into 1600 Pennsylvania Avenue. Newt's advice to Palin is pretty sophomoric, but it is also advice that keeps her at bay. It is also patronizing, and it's also wrong. He writes, uh, his, it's his advice for her comeback. Well, that's fascinating. Last time I checked, Newt Gingrich saying something on Fox News didn't change Senate legislation. Last time I checked, Newt Gingrich writing something or sending out his free newsletter didn't affect the quality of our lives. Sarah Palin's existence changes things. She has chosen to use that in an appropriate manner. Whether that continues, I don't know. This is all in the here and now. So here, this is his advice for her comeback. Obviously already wrong. What, what comeback? I, did, she, I don't, when did she leave? When did she leave? Here's his six points of what Sarah should do from Newt Gingrich, the man who got kicked out. Well, effectively he resigned, but truly uh, he was beaten by Clinton. One, write a book. Yeah, he applauds that, by the way. Yeah, that's genius. Two, land a regular commentator slot on television. Says it's a sure way for an outsider to stay inside the national dialogue. It's funny, an outsider. He thinks she needs to become an insider. Newt Gingrich doesn't realize what stinks about him and everyone else in Washington is the fact that they're insiders. And what we like about her is that she's not. Oh, it's a great way to stay inside the national dialogue and keep in touch with incumbents and activists and strategists who can help launch your comeback. Oh I, oh, I see. She needs to be enveloped by the system. Mm -hmm. so that's genius, isn't it? Yeah. Three, consider getting a condo in New York or Washington. You know, this is funny because nothing west of the Mississippi matters. You know, California, Alaska, whatever. you got to get a condo in New York and Washington so you can be part of us. You know what this is, too? It's desperation. This is a desperation, knowing that Sarah Palin's powerful, and they want to now change her.